take one of the unboxing and overview of the Sony HDR CX900 camcorder. Uh, the reviews on this camcorder is pretty good. Uh, its biggest uh, asset is it's got a one inch sensor, which is pretty big, and it has a manual focus ring, iris control, white balance, and shutter. So uh, I was looking for a, uh, something that I could have uh, more handheld, uh, so we bought this. So we have some uh, documentation here. Limited warranty. I'm sure everybody's seen that. And the contents of the box. We have the camcorder itself. Right here we have the lens hood. And that is the battery. Over here we have the remote control. This is nice. I use these all the time in my other camcorders. Doesn't feel too bad. Good quality. Typical Sony. Then we have some power cords. It's a USB extension. We have the micro USB to, I believe that's a micro D to a regular USB 2.0 cable. And then you got the uh, Sony wall charger. This will plug right into the camera. And then your uh, cord goes into that. And you can power the unit. If your batteries are low or you're going to do some extended recording. Then we have the uh, camera itself. Uh, very good quality. It's got some, definitely got some weight to it. Um, nice handle. Feels good. We have the uh, 5.1 surround sound speaker up front. Sony hot shoe adapter, but it only works with their. Hot shoes equipment. We have the zoom rocker, the photo switch, that's for the top. On the back, you have the eyepiece, the auto manual focus, ND filters. This is really nice when you get ND filters on a camera this small. You have your movie mode, photo switch, your start record. That I believe is the port to plug in for the power. It's the battery compartment right here. On this side, you have the zoom or focus. So this uh, ring here on the lens will control one of those. Uh, I usually leave it at focus and then use the zoom rocker to control the uh, zoom. And you have a control here. That is the manual, if you want to go in manual mode. Iris, gain, and shutter speed, I believe is all set by this. Then you got a mini HDMI port out. 
I, uh, someone told me that this does uncompressed video out. I'm going to find that out in a minute. If I can get the uh, autonomous Ninja Blade to work with it. Headphone jack, that's always nice. And we have a couple ports right here. There's a microphone in. It's kind of hidden here. And a micro HDMI port. Give you kind of a zoom in look on this. This video has been recorded on a Canon EOS 7D using a Sennheiser MKE 600 shotgun mic. Thank you for watching this video and please subscribe to my channel. Take two. On this side of the camera you have the SD card slot right here. You have the display button that's a forward button, power button, white balance, program AE, and that's what the display looks like. It goes on. And you got a little, I think that is a speaker, believe it or not. And the display is 3.5, it's really nice and clear. And then you have the iris button, the gain, ISO, shutter speed. That's the front of the uh, Zeiss T T uh, T Sonus lens, I believe, 2.8 to 9.3. The 24x clear image zoom, and you can magnify the shot with that button right there. This will conclude part two of the overview of the Sony HDR CX900 camcorder. Thank you for watching this video.